see can you see the buttons now probably not all you can see is my double chin <laughs> it's saturdays with sarah but also sometimes sunday because i am a full-time student and i'm really busy yeah hey friends it's sarah welcome back to my channel um, so I have been home for a few weeks this summer back in NorCal and I've been struggling a little bit with what to film because a lot of my ideas like rely on me being back in Fullerton at like my permanent residence where all my stuff is. But me, my sister, and my mom went shopping yesterday to Target, Target <laughs> and bought a lot of stuff. So I figured I would do a little try on haul for you guys. I got a few cute little pieces. So yeah, I'm gonna put all that on for you. All right, this is the first little outfit I got. I think they actually go really cute together. Um, so this on top is a little purple, teal, pink striped bodysuit. It's really comfortable and I just love the colors. I'm trying to get like more crazy colored stuff in my wardrobe. So I thought this was perfect. It's got a little like swoop neck in the back. And I think this neckline is really flattering. And then I got this skirt. It's just like a basic black denim skirt. I like that it's really high waisted and it's still long enough to where if I like bend over my whole ass won't be out. I think I got the bodysuit in a medium and this skirt is a size 10. I'm mean, usually around a size eight at Target, but it just, just depends. But this fits me pretty good. And I'm really excited to wear this outfit. I feel like you could dress it up or down with a little heel or a Birkenstock. Yeah, first outfit. Also, I got this new watch. Let's see if you can see it. It's a, what brand is it? Armatron Pro Sport Digital Watch. I've been looking for like a cute digital watch for work because I have to have one. Well, I have to have a watch and I just like timing and like the exact minute is very important for my job. So like I don't want an analog clock. Um, but yeah, I just stumbled upon this one. I think it's really cute. It is in Disney look, which is very important. Just white and gold and it's really thin. A lot of digital watches are super thick and like just like bulky and gross. <laughs> But I think I'm just gonna wear it like most of the time because I hate checking my um, like the time on my phone now that I am used to like looking at a watch for work. So I think I'm just gonna wear this all the time. I think it's cute. It's like subtle. Um, so these pants were kind of a wild card. I almost didn't get them because I wasn't sure if they were like flattering or not. Um, because of the cut, they're like you can tell they're like capris and I just always feel weird about capris because I have really long legs and I feel like they just like look awkward on me but I've been wanting a pair of pants like this for a while because for Sigma Kappa meeting we wear business casual every Monday or every other Monday and all the girls have these like cute like checkered business um, pants that are really in right now and I am always jealous when I see them wear them and like with heels, I think these would be really cute. And they're pretty comfy, like they have a stretch back. So I'm excited to have these just to have some more like nice pants if I have like a job interview as well. And I think these are a medium and they definitely have some stretch to them, so. And then this top I got in maroon too, which you'll see in a second. But it's just like a basic, I don't know what this is called. That like stretchy, you know what I'm talking about, <laughs> material. And I like it because it looks like one of those like off the sleeve tops and you could wear it like that. But off the sleeve tops kind of irritate me because then you don't have like full range of motion in your arms. So this one, you can just kind of wear and have it lay on the shoulder and I think it looks nice. I tried this on in a medium and large and they were virtually exactly the same. So I got the large just cause it'll probably shrink and Bigger is better than too small. Okay, next I got this little like spring um, sundress. The thing that like made me want to go to Target was they have a lot of really cute, my watch came unlatched. They have a bunch of really cute like spring like floral dresses. So I found this one. I really love like the color of the flowers. You can see they're like magenta pinky and these little like fake buttons that go up and down 
and it has little like pinched in sleeves. I just love a good little like dress. Like you can just throw it on and then you look all cute and dressy and you don't have to like throw a whole outfit together. So I like obsessed with this dress. I'm like trying to think of like an occasion that I can wear it for already. I feel like I can just like imagine myself like dancing in like a field in this. Okay, this one's a little bit of like a wild card for me because it's like a little bit out of my comfort zone. But um, the jean shorts are mine. I just threw these on to like pair with it. I think like a skinny jean with rips would probably look better, like a, like a dark skinny jean. But this is the shirt I got. It's like a button up little leopard shirt with a collar. Leopard is very in right now, and of course now that I just bought a bunch of leopard shit, it'll probably like go out right away because <laughs> I'm a little late to the trend, but I'm really into it all of a sudden. So I got this little leopard shirt, this little crop. You kind of button it all the way up to the top if you're feeling like studious or have it open a little, which is probably what I'll do. Make it a little bit more casual, but yeah, I think it's really cute. Again, you can dress this like up or down, like with like a black jean and heels. It'd be like, I can see. I forgot to tell you this, but the dress that I just had on was a medium. And this shirt is also a medium. So, for your reference. Look at that, look at that. Is it cheetah or leopard? Cheetah? <laughs> I don't know, they're the same thing. <laughs> okay, I figured I would just show you this now because it doesn't really go with anything else I bought. And we are talking about cheetah slash leopard print. So, I got this little, can you see it? belt it's like kind of furry which kind of makes me feel weird obviously it's like not real but like there's got like a little furry texture to it i used to really hate belts like i thought they were super uncomfortable but i've been into them lately like i feel like with just like a like a crop top and jeans when you add a belt it like spices it up a little bit and this is a size medium okay same shorts but this shirt is pretty basic. It's funny because literally the day before I bought this, I was at my cousin Lindsay's and she like loaned me one of her shirts and it looked exactly like this. And I was like, I need more like kind of flowy shirts. So I got this in a large because I wanted it to be a little bit more loose. The medium was just like a little bit tighter on the chest. But I got this because I think it's like a flattering cut. It's just gray, but a lot of my shirts like this is still like a crop top but a lot of my crop tops are like skin tight so I figured it was good to get one that was a little more blousey if you know I have an, a bloated day or whatever so yeah it just has little buttons down the front a little like tie you could probably undo this but I'm not going to okay these pants were also a wild card um the ruffle is what like gets me a little bit this little let me show you closer there's like a ruffle on the top that kind of like like my torso is a cupcake i kind of like it though like i think the the shape of these pants is really flattering like it's they're tight on the bootay and they're like pretty pretty tight like like business casual pants you want them to be like fitted but not like you know so I think they fit good and I like how this waist is really cinched and high-waisted and you can cinch it even more with this little like matching belt that it came with. The ruffle is definitely a little out of my comfort zone. Um, but I think I could rock it with like a, like as long as you tuck your shirt in, like just like a plain black tucked in shirt. Um, I really like these pants. I think they're cute. Again, with like a little heel, I would definitely wear these to Sigma Kappa meetings or if I had a little bit of a, a fancy business event to go to. These are a size 10. Also, they have great pockets. So do the other ones. I feel like I just like, I can put my hands in them. I'm not used to that. Most girls' pockets suck and are like a centimeter deep, so. And then this shirt is just exactly the same as the yellow one. Still a size large. I think it's really cute. I just like the cut and I liked both colors. So I got both of them. All right, folks, we're almost done. We are nearing the end of this little haul. I am a little winded. I'm embarrassed to say. I feel like trying on clothes is like exercise in itself. Um, 
anyway, this shirt is just mine. I just paired it with this because it's kind of hard to match with a leopard pink skirt. But I got this skirt. I think it's really cute. I like how it's high-waisted and still, you know, long enough to cover the parts. Um, it has just like a little zipper up at the back. And at first, I almost didn't buy it because I thought it wasn't... Like, it's kind of a thinner material, so it doesn't really, like, suck the gut in like you would hope. But I decided it was cute. And I think it's just, like, a statement piece. Like, it's just, like, a fun-ass skirt to wear. Um, it is a size 12, which makes me a little depressed because I thought it was, you know, out of the 12s. But it's fine. Everything is sized differently. Doesn't mean I gained weight. It's fine. <laughs> um, but, yeah, this is my cute little leopard skirt. I'm really excited to wear it to like a cute little dinner or something. I swear this is the last leopard print thing that I got. I promise. And then I'm just gonna throw this puppy on top. This is the last item. Second to last? Yeah. This is just a size large oversized jean jacket. It doesn't really go great with this outfit but you know just imagine <laughs> um i've been wanting i got a huge oversized black denim jacket from target a few months ago and it's like my favorite thing in my closet it's just like so comfy and looks good with everything so i've been on the uh, hunt for like a light wash one and i also really love distressed denim jackets so i found this one it's kind of cropped, so it's like oversized in the sleeves, but it's still cropped like a normal jacket. Looks like it was like cut off. And it has little little distress marks everywhere. I think it's super cute. Again, this one's a size large. I just like having jean jackets that are like big so you can layer stuff under them and not feel like you like can't move your arms. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Hello. But yeah, I love this jacket. I'm really excited to wear it when it gets a little chilly cold. All right, and then I also got these, what size are these? Size large. I tried on a medium too. Actually, I didn't try on a medium. They didn't have a medium. Medium probably would have fit better, but these are just like cloth sleeping shorts and they have a drawstring. So I was fine getting the large because I just want them to be comfy. I would try these on, but I am honestly winded and I'm getting a little hungry, so we're over it and then i just got these basic flip-flops fun fact about me it's really hard for me to buy shoes because i have literally the highest arches in the world and i also have that little like it's a gross name it's called a bunion <laughs> but it's like that bone that sticks out of the side of your foot like by your big toe so with a high arch and that bone sticking out it's really hard to find cute sandals that like will fit me most of them just like my foot doesn't go in so I needed these just like basic flip-flops to slip on I didn't have a pair of flip-flops and then I always buy their fake what brand is this mad love Birkenstocks I've never had real Birkenstocks I just buy these ones they're comfy they last me about like six months before they get kind of stinky and worn out but I really like the ones that have like the toe hold but yeah thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this little try on haul i have a few um video ideas coming up i really want to do like what i eat in a day and finally a room tour i've lived in this apartment for like eight months and i haven't done a room tour but i'm moving back in long story don't ask um and I'm going to redecorate a little. So I'm probably going to do a room tour after I get that redecorated. Really excited to wear all my new clothes from Target. Some people hate shopping at Target because like everyone goes there. And like I know there's like a high chance that I'll see some bitch on the street wearing the same outfit as me. But that doesn't really bother me that much. I like shopping at Target because I think they have cute, pretty affordable things. And their sizes are like realistic. Like when now that I'm a little chunkier... Whenever I go to like Forever 21 or like any of those like trendy girl stores, their sizes like I'm like an extra extra large at Forever 21 and it's just like not fun. It's like, like Target is like normal people sizes. Like I'm like a medium, usually maybe a large at Target and it just makes me feel a lot better because it's like realistic sizes and they have good selection, cute stuff. 
affordable so we love Target. Yes, I call it Target because why would you not? Uh, but yeah, if you guys liked this try on haul or just the style of video in general, let me know down below with a big thumbs up or a comment. And if you haven't subscribed down below already, what are you doing? Hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell to let you know every time I post because sometimes your girl's a little inconsistent. Also, PSA, I might be getting a bunny soon, so if you want to see bunny content, <laughs> definitely subscribe. I'm really excited. Okay, I'm going to end the video now. Thanks so much for watching. Later.